What's going on guys? Welcome back to the Brewster Show. Today we're going to be playing a new game. Supposedly this game is extremely scary, as I always say. But they end up not being scary. So, hopefully this one will be. Uh, supposedly you're a... You're working a night shift at a graveyard. So... I mean, graveyards are kind of creepy, in my opinion. Especially at night. But anyway, I don't want to take too much time. Let's go ahead and get into this. In the silence of the night, demons ambush our thoughts. And madness unfurls its flags in our hearts. For sometimes the darkest corners of our minds. Already pretty creepy atmosphere. I'm not sure about this. I don't know if I'd want to work here. Pretty smooth camera. Enter the Whispering Mind. I don't know if I really want to, though. I can run. That's great. Who are you? Are you the one to tell me I'm going to be working the night shift? I'm glad to see you. And I'm sure we've hired a great guardian. That's a great ventriloquist act you've got going on there, bud. I know that during the first few nights, you might not feel comfortable in this place, and may be a bit scared, but you'll get used to it soon. <laughs> scared? This cemetery is the most peaceful place at night, and you'll find enjoyment in the tranquility and silence of this place. Why are you talking like that? Of course, you need to be very vigilant and make sure no one enters. You should know that many famous people are buried here. Buried here. <laughs> Go to Johnny's to get all the details from him. Okay, tab to check. The warehouse, the church, the foos, the security room, the dissection hallway. Okay. But where am I? Am I like down here at the bottom? Where where am I located though? What is this? Okay. Okay, good. Uh, don't go down there. I'm glad because I wouldn't. So don't go in there. Go this way, I guess. In here? No. Okay, then where do I go now? Was I supposed to just go past him? I don't mind me just coming through there, but... Alrighty. Well. This looks very ominous. Do I go in the church? No. Is that the church? Uh, 
Um, oh, it's behind the church. Okay. Oh, I can jump. Sweet. Car, 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 car. You must be the new night shift guard. You should know that guarding the cemetery isn't easy. You know, I think it's pretty cool that I can read your mind. The cemetery is equipped with CCTV cameras due to the burial of many famous individuals. You must regularly check the cameras and never let anyone in. Tonight, the cemetery has three guests. Due to the time constraints and a lack of proper and secure mortuary around the city, they had to store the bodies of the Ghost Rock group here tonight. Tomorrow, Ghost the Rock group will be held, and you must be very attentive at the cemetery. Is that a cult? There's something very important that the priest told me not to tell you, but I'll share it with you. The previous night shift guard died of a heart attack, and we found his body at the church door with a bluish complexion and a terrified look on his face. Should I go home then? I don't want to scare you, but I thought it's better that you know and stay more alert. If you have any questions or encounter any issues, please contact me. Remember to regularly check the cameras. Okay, thanks. Bye. Uh, don't do that. Whatever that was. What is that? What am I getting stuck on, man? What is this that I'm stuck on? I don't understand what that is. Invisible wall? I don't know. An invisible box? Maybe. Oh my goodness, I thought this was somebody standing there. I'm dumb. The tall man is still in the grave. I have to ask him to go. This guy? I didn't even see him standing there. Hello, sir. We're closing up for the night. Uh, excuse me, sir. I must ask you to leave this place. This cemetery is closed from 5 p.m. onwards, and I have to lock the gate. Thank you, creepy tall man. I have to close the door so no one else enters. Why does he walk like that? I seem nervous. Did he get upset by my words? Um, I think he just looked creepy to me, honestly. Come on, game. I want you to be really scary, bro. I want you to terrify me. I want you to send me to the bathroom. Ow. Torch doesn't need any oil yet. I didn't know I had a torch. I feel like I'm on observation duty. What the hell is that? What does that arrow mean? I 
Please don't tell me like one of those things we're gonna like get up and Okay, not doing that. Examine the water pipe. Where was that even at? I don't remember. Was it on the other side? Where's the dog? What? Why is there a dog? Found, find the death statue. What? Have you ever heard the cries of a demon? No. I don't want to. Oh, hi. Oh. I can't believe my eyes. What was that? Who were those people? Why did they stand there like that? Check the footage. Yeah, that's what they're standing. But they're not there now. I wonder if you'll catch them on camera. I wonder if they just disappeared somewhere else. Why does this one look a little blurry? So far, everything looks normal. Hello, Jesus. Uh, hopefully that uh, wheelchair doesn't move. Um, yeah, that was not on the floor before. Where's that? The dissection room? That's weird. Do I need to investigate that anomaly? A change has occurred in the dissection hall. Check it out. Oh no. All I can say right now is, oh no. I'm gonna die. You know, it's funny how you weren't open before, and now all of a sudden you're just now opening. Uh, yeah. So, where where's the the the, the camera? <laughs> it should be right there, but it's invisible. <gasps> oh. Oh my god. I, I, I love how I just get scared by that. Why would that scare me? I don't know. Put you back on the bed. Ow! Why did you have to scream in my ear, buddy? Uh, what was that for? Why do you do all that? Anything in here? What's this? Can't take it. 
Okay. Well, this has been real illuminating, but I gotta go now. A skull, huh? A skull. That is not whether it's not whether it's real or fake. I got an achievement for that. All right. Someone's ringing the phone. Calm down. What the F was that? Um, hi. What's your name? Who are you? Okay, everything's normal in those rooms. There's some... Some weird guy is at the door. I gotta tell him to leave. I can't. I'm locked. I am the security guard of the cemetery, and I am leaving a message for the next guard here. I am here at night between 3 and 4 a.m., and I see a very frightening nun on the... I see a very frightening nun on the east side of the cemetery sitting over a grave, but I don't dare to approach her. Her crying is intensely eerie and disturbing, and it's unbearable. I have recently found a solution that can make her voice somewhat more tolerable for you. Just whisper Jesus Christ 20 times. We don't know what this nun is, but I'm certain that she is not human. What? No. Oh my goodness. Okay. Why well, won't it let me out? There's no key. I need to take a nap. Okay. So we're just not gonna investigate the guy there? Uh, what is this? Yeah, that's not creepy at all. This is definitely a nightmare. Can I not go anywhere else? Do I have to jump in this hole? Geronimo! Oh god, there's a lot of eyeballs.
Yep, that's a lot of eyeballs. Definitely doing that now. What? Why is this dish spilled? Oops, I meant to lock that earlier, but I... Well... Whatever. Why is that alarm going off? Pick the flashlight and find a way to disable the car alarm. What flashlight? Oh, this one. Oh, lordy. I need a tool in a warehouse. Excuse me? Wouldn't this be the tool to use? Oh, that tool. Alrighty. Disconnect the alarm wire, otherwise the car's battery may run out. Go back to the room, okay? What? Can you say that again, but in English? I don't understand. The fuse blown. Find the fuse. Go back to the security room and check the CCTV. I'm sorry, but that is uncalled for. Bruh, I would quit. I'm sorry, I would quit. It'd be time to go home. Fuck this job. Fuck the graveyard shift. I'm out of here. Okay, nobody on these two. Still nobody here. Nothing going on inside the church, I see. Nothing there. What is that? Again? We got two of them off the thing now. Well, great. We gotta go back that way. Is him to change? I don't like it.
So, this is what the guy was saying when the guy had a heart attack and died. Because of all this shit that's been happening. The, the the picture's gone. Unless it's on the ground. No, it's not even here. Oh, fuck! What in the... F find a way out. The key should be around here. We will not be buried here. He is stepped at... What is this? There's a key. Is it for this door? What is this? Axe for woods. <laughs> well, I got an axe. Uh, hi, lady. I don't like, I don't want that. No. 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 <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, my goodness. Dude. This game is getting me. Bro, I, I know what's gonna happen here. What do you mean there's no key in my inventory? There is a key in my inventory. I literally picked up a key, did I not? It said key was added to inventory. Okay, I got that. No night vision and glow stick. Bro, I thought I picked up a key, man. smashing so I picked up the wrong key then Keep Johnny informed by phone. Yeah, there's whatever was staring at me, bro. That shit was creepy as hell. They probably cut the phone line. They won't let me, you know, using their, uh, the shadow man's here. Bro, I had a thought, and you ruined the thought. How are you getting in here? You're locked out. Johnny! Hello? Hello, Mr. Johnny. There's a problem. What's going on there? I just realized that the bodies are not in their place. What should I do? Mr. Johnny? I can't hear you. 
Can you hear me? Oh. No, Jesus. I believe he said he couldn't hear you. What do you guys want from me? No signal. There's a guy out there. Apparently someone's digging a grave in the cemetery. Check it out. I don't want to. What if it's a nun? He dug that grave. Where'd he go? I have to leave the center as soon as possible so I don't die myself. Is this supposed to be a cemetery guard or a damn ghost club? I will not stay here even for a moment. It looks like it's locked now. Shit. The lock's been changed. They won't let you leave. Get back to the security room. I'll just hide in there until the night's over. Close the door, lock it, hide under the bed. Could they get in then? They could just stare at me from the window. Oh, uh, hi. This game is creepy, bro. So far, so good. I'm really liking it. Who is that in the church? Check. Bro. You just said you didn't want to die. Like the last guard, or like you didn't want to be part of a ghost club, and now you're like, oh, there's someone in the church. And then you literally just saw the person, looks like a freaking ghost, demon witch, bitch. And now you want to go check it out? What the fuck is wrong with this guy? I'd rather not, bro. I'd rather just lay down, go to sleep, wait till the morning, and then leave. And then never come back. You know, this guy's not very smart, though, so. Nobody ever is in horror games. Hey! hey. We have buried the ones in the cemetery. Have a message for you. For years, a demon has been buried here, tormenting our souls. Now you are condemned to destroy the demon within the cemetery and save us from torment. Otherwise, a harsh death awaits you. Thank you. He 
You know, I'm so glad that you could have chosen me for your death sentence. By the way, if you guys want a God of War Ragnarok Valhalla DLC video, you let me know because I've thought about doing it, but, you know, because it's free. But I have to take it apart out of my living room and I have to bring it in here. And then I have to take apart the Xbox that I have in here. And, um, yeah, it's just a just a hassle so if you really want it you let me know I know a lot of youtubers have done it so it's probably wouldn't be new to see me do it Couldn't use this crowbar in the, the regular lock out, you know, on the gate. I'm sure you could have done that on the main gate. They led me here. There must be something I'm putting here. Yeah, your demise. Smith, 1932. Taylor, 1940. Um, yes. I'm looking for something. Okay, never mind. Goodbye, then. Hi there, you creepy man. What's up? Can I do something for you? No? Okay, bye. Jeez, who created this place? I mean, obviously the developer did, but that's not what I was talking about. Williams are Britain family youngest child. Between books and rotten corpses. Okay, locked. See ya. I go in here. What? Uh, going down again. Excuse me? What? Wait, didn't I just go through here? Taylor. Smith. Oh. Never mind, I got confused. Okay, we don't can't go through these doors. So clearly there's something around that I'm missing. Looks like someone got shot right here. Jones closed.
Clearly I gotta do something with this door here or there's something on this. Bro, I didn't see this. I didn't, I didn't see this. Williams, Perryton. Hello, man. Gee, I was just gonna ask him about my haircut. Williams or Parrington, youngest child between books and rotting corpses. Why does it say or Britain family youngest child? Britain family? I don't understand. Oh! Okay. Well, that was simple enough. Kills us, someone was here today. Yeah, it looks lit. What's this on the ground? I don't know. What do we do with the chains? Here's an axe. Do we axe the chain? Sure do. Let's open this grave here and see what's in here. Wait a second, was it the guy that I saw standing at the front door? In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, Elias, although the devil has possessed your body and soul in this transient world, from today you will peacefully rest in eternal sleep because the merciful Lord keeps you away from the devil. Elias, may the Lord forgive your sins and place your soul in peace. 1917, Whispering Winds Graveyard. Exit the tomb. Was that what I was supposed to do? I'm not look I'm not looking. Go up the ladder. Faster! <laughs> Get up there! The ladder to nowhere! Maybe it puts me outside the graveyard and you can just go the fuck home. Is this the nun? Okay, I'm gonna leave her alone. Yeah, I'm gonna leave her alone. Cause the uh, the page said to leave her alone. Never mind. I guess if the game wants me to go check it out, I'm gonna get a heart attack. I'm dying today. Hello, can I help you? Would you like some help, lady?
Okay. Very fugly, that nun. Oh no, she's mad. Sorry, I didn't mean it. Just kidding, I did mean it. Ha <laughs> ha! Stupid nun. No, I just was wanting to lock. What are you doing? Can you lock it? Quit opening the door and lock the door. Bro, you're you're getting you're getting annoying. Okay, fine, fuck it. Whatever. Oh my god, again with the car. This guy is over here digging the grave again. There's this um uh, skeleton bitch. Who the hell is that guy? Uh, didn't I disable that? Everybody's mad now. Uh, Jesus, you look a little different. That's creepy. See you in hell. Devil does not burn. Leave the area. How the fuck am I gonna do that? There's always a way out. Oh god, hi! What in the world was that? I died? I don't think dying would look like this, would it? Oh, I, uh... Where am I, bro? If this is death, I don't want to experience it. Because <laughs> this just looks creepy as hell to me. Okay. No, play the tape. Ready? Play. Okay. Hello, dear viewers. Today's true story is about a man who was hired as a security guard at the Whispering Winds graveyard. However, on the first night, he realizes that the spirits in this cemetery are asking him to destroy the body of a demon-possessed man buried there as it torments them. 
the naive and unsuspecting guard believes them and burns the body of the demon-possessed man. But he didn't know that the spirits are not visible and everything he saw was of demonic nature. Now the demon has awakened again and the spirits of whispering winds are in torment. Death was the only punishment for this security guard. So I died? Is it... Don't look it uh, uh, at up. Don't look it up. Don't look what up. Hello, dear viewer. Oh. So am I dead? What What do I do now? Don't look up, is what I was saying. <laughs> um, what? Excuse me? I'm back. Just that simple. The gates open and everything. Okay. The bodies are in their places. There's no sign of last night's nightmare. That's good. Um, I quit. You can have your stupid job. I don't want it. Never again while I come back here. This was the first night of guarding at Whispering The first Wind's night history. was absolutely I terrible. Think it would be that being the guard in this place revitalizes the human spirit. Um, more like illuminated me into not coming back. See you around. Never again. I get to drive, heck yeah. What makes a woman I hope this isn't copyright. Hang her with I hope to give you the whole experience, not half the experience. That's why I hate copyright nowadays. Like, okay, I understand like a movie being copyrighted and you can't watch the whole movie and see everything that's been paid for, but a video game? I mean, the whole purpose is to play it and show it off, isn't it? Anyway, if this is the end of the game, this was a great game. And for $7, you can't beat this game, bro. This is perfect. Amazing for 7 bucks.
Oh, fuck. Excuse me. What the absolute F? Come on, dude. Get out of the car. Are you stuck in the car? I'm dead. The car's gonna explode. How did you get out? Have you ever heard the cries of a demon? Oh god. I can't go that way. What's the purpose? Am I just running back? Do I have to run back to the graveyard? No? Okay, I'm stuck in this area. Clearly there's something. Well then. You know, not many games can do that to me and scare me like that. However, the end of it didn't really scare me because you know, they scared me the whole time, but within the graveyard, that was terrifying. I'm really glad I played this. It was a great experience. All right. If you guys enjoyed that, don't forget to smash the like button. Subscribe if you're new. It always helps out the channel. Let's me know you're enjoying it. Let's me know you want the content. That way I keep rolling it out. All right. Alright. Well, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.